children and mummies and daddies. Today we are going to make Squirrel Nutkin's Autumn Tree. Now this children is our autumn picture just like Abby's been telling you about. Emma and Abby did this to show you what you can do. Now dear children if you can see Abby has drawn with crayon a tree first and I've surrounded the tree with blue sky and I even drew a golden sun in the sky and we've even put green grass because the grass is still green in the autumn time isn't it there are leaves falling down and these leaves have come from the leaves that we've pressed. The leaves that you've pressed underneath the books once you've collected them in the garden. And Abby's taken small leaves because our paper is not so big. But if you have a bigger piece of paper, you can take any size you like, any beautiful autumn leaves that you like. Now, over here, Abby drew Squirrel Natkin's house his little hole in the tree and on the ground as the leaves fall down when brother wind blows there are the leaves making a carpet for mother earth to go to sleep and keep warm in the winter and there dear children over there is squirrel nutkin and there squirrel nutkin is sitting nicely eating a nut and abby's going to send mummy a nice picture uh, or a pattern rather for mummy to cut out. You can cut out squirrel nutkin from a uh, piece of material or a piece of felt or even you can cut it out of paper, a different color piece of paper or you can color it in and draw it, whatever you like to do. You create a beautiful autumn picture to put up on your wall and to be proud of. And mummy and daddy can even maybe frame it for you and so it can look so beautiful on the wall. Now dear children I hope you enjoy this. I look forward to hearing all about it. Bye bye.